it seems to me that we're living in a world where the norm is a total disconnect from the food source. And that someone who is connected to this source is perceived as some kind of monster for killing their own animal. Which I think is really ironic, since ultimately this can be such a sacred experience. My intention was to grow a lot of food, my own food, and I installed one aviary of birds with the intention mostly of eggs and meat. But I rather fell in love with the birds and uh, rather quickly started uh, gathering some rare breeds. So this is a uh, uh, breast. I have I am Samani. Just started the Sumatras. I have the Barbazi. I'm developing the black morans. I have the Thai birds, the Thai game fowl. Uh, preserving the silver cuckoo morans. I just got a breeding pair of malinas or malines, and we'll see what happens with those. <laughs> so this is what we put into our custom mix: soaked organic peas, sprouted wheat which I soaked for a couple of days, black oil sunflower seed, white millet, rolled barley, which is pre-moistened overnight in a small measure of water, grit, oyster shell chips, kelp powder, trace mineral powder of ancient seabeds, organic soy powder, oil, today it's grapeseed. Occasionally I put a little organic corn or red millet. This is about 24 hours worth of mix. Why do I love chickens? Um, well, on a serious note, they kept me alive. My partner died three years ago. And having the chickens really gave me a lot of purpose and focus. They're delightful. They, they delight me. Raising my own meat is important. I really don't approve of how commercial corporate meat is raised. If I'm going to eat meat, I wanted to eat something that was really had a content, happy, good life. I mean, these birds, these birds are, um, they're, they're happy. And why do I choose this method? I think it's, it's more gentle and kind. It's a more humane way. It uh, is one of the ways that the bird can breathe easily um, because the trachea is uncut. And you'll see that the bird remains more calm throughout the death.
So one thing I'd like to show is uh, including the use of the various organs and the blood, often discarded in our culture. The intestines, the gizzard, the heart, the testicles, the lung. These things can be used. Blood has a lot of vitality, keeping healthy and young. 